Welcome to Terraria Episode 4, and this time I'm going to fight the Destroyer, which is the third mechanical boss in hard mode. This is the arena I've built. I've got I've moved my health statues down here. It's in the jungle, just because it happened to be. And here comes the Destroyer. And my basic idea, as you can see, is to stand up above him and use the yo-yo to do damage. And I've got the flask that decreases enemy defense when they when they get hit. I don't know if that's effective against this guy, but I'm using it anyway. Um, this is actually the second time that I fought the destroyer. And the first one, unfortunately, NVIDIA Shadow Play screwed up and lost my recording of it. So I don't have that. Um, in that first attempt, I my arena was too high off the ground. And so the the destroyer wasn't getting up high enough for me to attack him. And so then I extended the arena down, like these the two bottommost levels you see of this arena were added while I was fighting the destroyer the first time. So I extended the arena down so that I could get him in range and then just before I killed him, day broke. So he literally had like 600 health out of his, you know, whatever it is, 120,000 um, and, and they ran away. So <laughs> that was uh, pretty disappointing to, to have gotten that close and lost it. So second time around, this time I know what to expect. I've got the arena in the right position. And for some reason in this fight, he's getting plenty high enough for me to attack him even in the upper levels. I, I don't know why the first time around he wasn't willing to come up this high. Uh, but anyway, so once again I've got my health statues, which make the fight uh, pretty safe, although he did get me down pretty low right at the beginning of the fight. And then this yo-yo just does massive amounts of damage, so... He's, he's already getting close to half health. And he... These little orbs that, that come popping out are... annoying, of course. They, they do damage when they shoot you. But the... Uh, the Demon Scythe does a de decent job of getting rid of them. Uh, but the other crucial thing is that both the Destroyer and these little orbs shoot lasers, but the lasers don't go through walls. So that's why the arena is relatively small here. I only need enough space to maneuver to get out of the way of the worm, and otherwise I want the walls close together so that these, uh, so I can't get shot by, by the lasers as much. If you try to fight this guy in a completely open area, you get absolutely destroyed. <laughs> by all the, the lasers, because like every segment of his body will be shooting lasers at you if you're out in the open. With the, with the right arena, this fight is really... You know, I probably could have fought him first. Um, I don't think I had this yo... No, I didn't have this yo-yo at the beginning of hard mode, but... Uh, I could have... I think I could have beaten him with, with what I did have. It. And it says in the lower left, the jungle grows restless. That's because the next boss, Plantera, is now available to fight. Yeah, let's see what Luda got. 40 souls of might, 31 hallowed bars. I guess that's a little bit more than I thought. And then that final wagon piece means I can make the, uh, the good uh, minecart. 
So that's the end of this episode, and in the next, I think I'll probably fight Plantera. <laughs>